This forecast makes some people nervous. They want to get back to normal. Flooding around Grapevine Lake, for example, has kept some roads closed for more than a month and left behind a lot of damage. In some places, stagnant flood water still has not receded. Fox 4's Deanna Zoga is in Grapevine tonight with an update. Deanna. Well, Rich, like you said, that flood water is keeping a couple of roads closed around here. You can tell by some of the lines of, of uh, debris here in the road that the water has come down over time, but clearly not enough to reopen the street. It is two lanes in each direction, and cars cannot get through on Dove Road south of Grapevine Lake. We've seen a few people drive up to the roadblocks here, turn around. The signs are positioned in front of a line of concrete blocks, making sure no one moves those to get around the closure. The city says there's no clear timetable on when Dove Road will reopen, and that's the case on Fairway Drive in Grapevine and in Flower Mound. Several inches of water, you know, still coming over the spillway from the lake, and those cities do not know when that water will completely recede thanks to the remnants of a wet spring that just won't leave us. It, it seems that way, you know, when, especially when you see this every other day, you're like, God, you know, it should be gone by now, but unfortunately it's not. Yeah, and Flower Mound and Grapevine officials are watching rain forecasts over the next few days. They're waiting for the conditions to change. The Army Corps of Engineers, they say that the Grapevine Lake is just full enough to have water coming right over that spillway. Lake Louisville is another one that's spilling. In fact, most of our lakes are full. And Rich, the Army Corps of Engineers says it'll be a couple of months before they see that water recede out of those flood pools. Can you believe it? A couple more months.